The Senate is going to vote on a bill barring the president's vaccine mandate for large private companies. And the gentleman on the right-hand side of your screen is Senator Mike Braun from Indiana, who is leading the charge with this bill. Let me get this straight, sir. It only applies to the private sector mandate. Is that correct? That is correct. That's when they uh, came up with this brainstorm that after we were trying to help uh, small employers keep their employees, now you're going to put them in what I'm taking from across mainstream America, these 100 to 500 uh, employee businesses, it's got them more scared than anything. Thank goodness the courts are weighing in across the board. And the only formal tool we had here in Congress, one smart thing they did years ago, is if you get out of bounds, you get too ahead of your skis, this Congressional Review Act says you can formally bring it to a vote in the Senate if you get 30 senators on board, I did that in a few days, then got the other uh, 20 Republicans, and then got Joe Manchin to go last Thursday. So we are going to get a vote. The House has got every Republican on a letter to do the same there. There are going to be at least 20 swing district Democrats, hopefully, that will get it to their threshold. We're at least moving this in a way that puts every senator ideally every House member on record that you're not for this nonsense where maybe 14 percent of the public agrees is a good idea. 86 percent thinks it's a terrible idea. If it goes forward as you hope it goes forward, ultimately it arrives on the president's desk and he will ultimately abandon it. He will veto it, I presume. So what you're doing is to somewhat uh, symbolic, but also putting great political pressure on moderates in the House who've got to face re-election in 2022, right? And they ought to take their cue, it was on a different issue, of what happened in New Jersey and Virginia. The mm. public, even in blue states, are only going to put up with so much nonsense. Look at de Blasio oh. in New York City, <sighs> Stop going it. out the door and he wants to ruin yeah. businesses. Look what they've been through. I mean, that is government gone wild. And when you get bureaucrats and politicians that start trying to tell the productive economy, Main Street, where I come from, this is how you do it. I think People aren't going to put up with it. No, they're not. I think public opinion has swung completely in your direction. The VAX mandate on private companies just will not, I hope, does not fly. Senator, good luck with your efforts and great to see you on the program today. Merry Christmas to you, Thank sir. Thank you. Same to you, Stu. You